Hey there Joomla fans, Tim Davis here. I'm a Joomla fan too. Today I'm not coming to you from Cairo. In this episode I thought I'd mix things up and instead of looking at something in Joomla or to install in Joomla or how to fix Joomla, we'd look at something that's for Joomla. Whether you're working on your own template or customizing a module or even just putting some images in an article to make things look good, Coming up with those images or finding those graphics that are free to use can be really tricky. And if you're buying them, it can be pretty expensive. So today we're going to look at a website where you can find free graphics, free images, and free videos, all for free, and you don't even have to give the attribution to where you got them from. So let's head on over to the computer and check it out. Thanks again for joining me on this journey of getting more enjoyment and success out of our Joomla sites. Be sure to subscribe and ring the bell for notifications so you don't miss any tutorials or live streams or other stuff happening on the channel. So as I said, we're going to look at a website where the images or videos or graphics are free and you don't need to give attribution. I'm all for giving credit where credit is due and some of the free sites uh, require you to put credits with your photos even if you aren't paying for them. And uh, like I said, that's great to give credit where credit is due, but it's nice to have things that are simple, be able to find images for your site. So let's check out the site. It's pixabay.com. You want to go to pixabay.com. And once you're at this site, in order to download any of the media that they're offering for free, uh, then you can uh, you need to sign up for a membership. I've never had any problems from signing up. I haven't gotten any spam that I'm aware of from them. And uh, if you have your own domain, you might even want to just sign up under Pixabay at your domain and see what comes to you to that address. But I haven't had any problems, as I said. Now, as you'll see here on the front page, they'll tell you that they're royalty free for anything you like, even in commercial applications, attribution, is not required and they have some really neat filters for searching for graphics so the other day I was looking for a graphic to put on a page with an, that had an important notice so I searched for important and you'll see from that first page there I actually had all images selected you can start out right away with the filter that they have here but let's just uh, not do that in this case and we run into a bunch of images that have to do with important or actually lots of ships and shipping containers for importing. I guess their algorithm turns that up. This top row is sponsored images. Uh, if you like any of these pictures, you absolutely have to have them. They're perfect for what you're doing. You could uh, click on them and buy them from Shutterstock. Otherwise, all of these images and all these graphics are free for you to use. Now we saw filters at the very beginning that we could have selected before the search, but we also have them up here that we can look through. There's popular, latest, editor's choice, all images. Maybe we just want to see vector graphics. So we click on that. The filter will then take us to a bunch of graphics that are lots of exclamation marks because we're searching for important. Ribbon around the finger, or string around the finger. Now let's suppose we want to tie it down even more and we want only horizontally oriented vector graphics. So we could select that drop down. Now most of these are square so that didn't really make much of a difference. We do have categories that we can search through here. There's also size if you want to pin it, put in a particular size. That's not really necessary though because uh, they offer you a number of key sizes for downloading. And then when you do download the images you just resize them as you upload them to Joomla. I will have a tutorial on how to resize images when you're uploading to Joomla coming up in a little while. And when that's ready, I'll put a card up here. Um, and if you want to search for a particular color, you could just look for the color. So I'll check that out. We'll look for orange and we'll go go. Now, just because there's a green one here as well, I'll show you this color filter the color stays checked when you select another color. So you could look for orange and green. And there's the only one that matches that category. So let's clear these filters and look for one more image. Let's look for a train. A train. And I'm going to look for a train. I only want photos of trains. I don't want graphics of them. I want this to be a horizontally uh, orient, uh, oriented um, image 
I'm going to skip category, although I guess I could go down to transportation and traffic just to rule things out. And I want a train picture that has orange in it. So it goes with one of the major colors of my Cybersalt logo. Click that and we will go, go. Now here's a bunch of orange-ish train pictures that I could use on my site. And you see also the other options we could pick for transparent, if there's any that have a transparent background, but there are none. Typically transparent in the background would be for uh, vector images, the ones that are PNGs. So we'll uncheck transparent and go. So let's say here's the image that I want to use. Let's use this one here. So a little bit more familiar um, uh, ratio of uh, height and width. I want to download this picture. So I click on it. And now over here, because I'm logged in, uh, it says free download. And when I click on free download, it's going to give me a choice. I could have 640 by 426, 1280 by 853, so on. A whopping 4,608 by 3,072. Uh, you just simply pick the size of the starting image that you want to work with because if you're going to resize it you could resize it down uh, after you upload it to Joomla and uh, if you want to know how to resize pictures after you've uploaded them to Joomla then I'll put another card to a tutorial here uh, I don't have that one yet but if you see a card up here I've done it and placed a card here we just click download and there we can just save it. I have just this folder for delete, save the image, and then we can open it up on our computers and you can manipulate it how you want. You could, uh, you could touch it up. You could upload it uh, directly to Joomla as is, but that's uh, as easy as that. And if you really appreciate a picture, you could buy the person. In this case, it was this fellow up here. You could buy him a coffee, give him a donation on through PayPal. You'll see that there are also the options to select videos. That's one thing I didn't mention before. And uh, if you want to check out a video, you can, oh, those are the ones sponsored by Shutterstock. You can just mouse over and it will start to play and you'll see what it looks like if you're using a video project or making a video project for your website. Or I suppose you could download these and convert them to a GIF and put them right onto your web page in order to play uh, wherever you want it. So looking for images or graphics or something for a template you're developing or you want to spiff up a module or you're just looking for an article to go Sorry, you're looking for an image to go with an article. Pixabay.com is a great site. I use it lots. I actually have a membership at a, on another site uh, for downloading pictures. It was a membership. It was pay once and have a lifetime membership. They were starting it up. And so I use that sometimes. But this Pixabay site is faster. And I've actually noticed some of the images that are for free on Pixabay are on the other site that is a membership site for access to downloading the pictures. So a question for you Joomla fans, do you have any other free picture sites that you use? Leave a comment in the section below and uh, that will give us all an opportunity to find other places that we can look for graphics if we don't find something here on Pixabay. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching. Enjoy your Joomla sites. God bless.